Centuries ago, master archers were able to perform incredible feats of archery. These skills have long since been forgotten, but the Danish archer Lars Andersen is trying to reinvent what has been lost. He uses forgotten historical methods and holds all his arrows in the same hand he shoots with. Once, this technique was widespread, and Assyrian artwork shows that the method is at least 5,000 years old. About 10 years ago, Lars started using a bow. The arrows he carried in a quiver on his back. Surprisingly, the quiver turned out to be useless when it came to moving fast. Placing the arrow left around the bow is not good while you're in motion. By placing the arrow on the left side, your hand is on the wrong side of the string, so you need several movements before you can actually shoot. From studying old pictures of archers, Lars discovered that some historical archers held their arrows on the right side of the bow. This means that the arrow can be drawn and fired in one single motion, which is both faster and better. A war archer must have total control over his bow in all situations. He must be able to handle his bow and arrows in a controlled way under the most varied of circumstances. Lars took it a step further and is now able to catch an arrow while jumping and fire it before he has to go. Taking it to this third level, that of holding arrows in the draw hand, requires immense practice and skill, and only professional archers, hunters, and so on would have had the time for it. When guns started replacing bows, this technique was forgotten, and the only reason Lars is able to do it is because he spent years practicing intensely. The hard part is not learning how to hold the arrows, but learning how to handle them properly and draw and fire in one single motion, no matter what method is used. It works in all positions and while in motion, whether rolling, running, or on horseback. It also works with sharp arrows and powerful bows. From old texts, we know that Saracen archers were expected to be able to fire three arrows in 1.5 seconds and very skilled archers were even faster. Lars has managed to shoot three arrows in 0.6 seconds, but while speed is important, hitting the target is essential. To test accuracy and speed at the same time, Lars set up an experiment where he shot incoming arrows with arrows of his own. Every guy to shoot at me, this is bullshit, I'm done. We do not recommend you trying this at home. Thank you for watching.